open a new document I am choosing 1500 by 1500 center the document make sure you have no fill and only stroke selected hit L on your keyboard to draw ellipse I am choosing 1000 pixels center it now go to the polygon tool and make a six sided polygon with 500 pixels center it hold shift and rotate it by 90 degrees with the pen tool draw a line from the top and intersection to the bottom intersection with the selection tool select the line and hit R on your keyboard and double click on the select uh, rotate tool and make it 72 degrees and hit copy make it 60 degrees and hit copy hit ctrl D to repeat it now select everything and deselect with with holding the shape the circle now with the pentagon select uh, hexagon selected uh, rotate it by 15 degrees and hit copy and hit control D to repeat the process deselect everything Select the pen tool and from the top point as shown, it's just on the left of the perpendicular line, draw a line to the bottom of the perpendicular and do the same on the other side. We select everything. Now select the two new lines you have drawn by holding shift and hit R on your keyboard to double click on the rotate tool and hit 15 degrees and copy and, and press ctrl D to repeat the process this is your design now we are going to color it select everything and pressing shift and alt on your keyboard increase the size so it makes easier now select the life paint option make the color starting black you can choose any color you want and start coloring the design if you want to have a two color design then you can have a two color design i'm using black and the rest will be transparent so in whatever background you put it the other color will always be the background color Be careful while doing this or because if you make a mistake the effect will be ruined now slowly fill in the colors if you make a mistake hit ctrl Z to go back and redo it since all of it is in a stroke it is still transparent everything is transparent and you can use uh, different colors for it you can always choose black and uh, another color to give it a contrasting effect
hit control 0 to go back to the central view that's your basic design now now we'll put a background behind it select the rectangle tool by pressing holding shift on your keyboard make a square which is bigger than the design you made and give it a color center it right click on the square go to arrange and send it to back you can always change the color whenever you want I am not happy with this one so I will change the color again I will give it a shade of blue that's your basic design